To write the name for BaO, we first need to realize we have an ionic compound here. That's because we have a metal bonded to a nonmetal. A metal and a nonmetal, that's an ionic compound. Specifically, this is called a binary ionic compound because we have two different elements. So for a binary ionic compound, we use these rules. We'll start out by writing the name of the metal as it appears on the periodic table. Ba, barium, that's the metal. So we write barium. Next, we write the name for the nonmetal as it appears on the periodic table. So oxygen with the lowercase o, and then we replace the ending with IDE. So we cross this out, IDE, and the name for BAO is barium oxide. If you were given the name and asked to write the formula, you need to realize that barium, when it bonds, it forms two plus ions. Oxygen forms ions with a two minus ionic charge. So you can see the two plus and the two minus, they balance out, give us a net charge of zero. So we only need one barium and one oxygen together for barium oxide. This is Dr. B with the name and formula for BAO, barium oxide. Thanks for watching.